Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to part 60 of Let's Play Albert Odyssey. It's Pike, Kia, Amon, Grizz, and Pig. And Amon's kind of pissed off about the random teleportations. No, no, we found the ship. We also found Guy. He broke it. That 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 is that is Eek. <laughs> yep. In the town of Anus, Angus. I'm going to be making that joke for the rest of the game, because I don't think we're going to go there too often. I think this is the last time we actually go there after this. And Alakazam. Poof. Pike's girlfriend is no longer a pig. And a dozen nipples. Okay, uh, we'll do the therapy later. Nope, nope, we're gonna laugh about Ika being a pig. Screw the world. It doesn't need to be saved. Oh, of course, it's the whole world domination. But, oh yeah. yeah. She's got magic. Then why don't we take the Holy Vessel? I mean, really, if we know of an artifact that powerful, why don't we just take it? Why did we just leave it there for her to, to steal? sounds disturbing. Alright, so Vred is going to Mycent. We need to go to Anus. Angus. Or Chastoria first, then Angus. Getting, yeah. <laughs> this just in. We don't get to hear what he says. What the hell? Yay, we get to go lead the charge. Because we're, you know, so a knight, and therefore qualified to do this. Alright, so now we head to South Gadel. After we leave the giant castle. 
Still leaving the castle. I think the castle of Gadel is the largest single structure that we have to, to deal with in this game. And the rest of the town is kind of poorly designed as far as getting through it. Oh crap. Dead guys in armor. Holy crap! And we get a fight that we're not actually participating in. We get to watch Balan versus Dimicus. And naturally, as a scripted fight, Balan's gonna beat the crap out of him. Because Balan keeps blocking, because he's a little pansy. God Slash? Holy crap. That didn't look like it's going well for Demicus. Or Decimus, excuse me. Okay, and he's actually dead, so now we're kind of pissed. So Balan traded in his normal flunkies for scythe-wielding demons. And they're all dying. We have the same shade of hair. All the demons vanish. So now it's like 30 on 1. Except he's a pansy and runs away. I would be so happy when we kill him again. Why does Balan have Mad Record? I thought Redoria took it in the very beginning. Alright. And after all the mess is cleaned up, all the, the dead people move from the, the streets. So yeah, we'll go ahead and save it here. And then we will uh, pick up in our next installment where we head to Chestoria. Alright, uh, until our next installment, later everyone.